Hello and welcome to this I2 video, which introduces the ability to inspect individual record details in search results before adding them to a chart in Analyst Notebook Premium 940, as well as in the I2 Notebook web client. So when you're bringing back searches from either an external connector or if you're working with EIA and the information store from quick searches or visual queries, the results lists now allow the user to view the full details for an individual record. So over here on the right, we've got a results list and we can see we've got a summary information for Faye Altenworth here. By clicking on the little eye icon over here, we can actually view the full details for that record without actually adding it to the chart. So I can see the properties, I can see the notes and where the record has geospatial properties, I can also see its location on a preview map. And just to reiterate, this is provided for external searches, which are obviously part of Analyst Notebook Premium, but also for quick searches and visual queries when working with the information store. In, it's available in the Notebook Desktop client, as well as with i2 Notebook. So both AMBP Desktop, as well as i2 Notebook, now include the ability to inspect record details for those individual search results before adding to them to chart. I will now demonstrate this new feature in both Analyst Notebook Premium as well as i2 Notebook. So I'm going to begin with a quick search. Okay, so let's just look for anything. And I'm going to filter that down to people. Okay, and let's just take an example. So there's Scott Keller. If I click on the little I symbol here, then I can now view the details for that record before it's added to the chart. Okay. Similarly, if I look at Joshua Gallo here, I can get the same details. What you will notice is that as I inspect that record, it will also select the record for me to be added to the chart. So if you don't want to do that, obviously you can untick it. Okay, if we were to change the filter, let's change it this time to addresses, and we just filter those down. If we choose to view that in the record inspector, not only do we get the properties, we also get the little preview map. Now this feature is also available in i2 Notebook. Okay, so let's just log into that. And we'll just go for a new chart while that's doing that. And we'll do the same quick search. Put it down to vehicles in this case. Click the little I. And once again, before I've even added it to my chart, I can view the properties of the notes and the details for that, that item. Okay, so that's a demonstration of the, the viewing of individual records before adding them to the chart.